be making a dump cake. I'm going to show you guys how I did it. Um, first off, you need a buttered um, pan or something that you're going to be putting it in. And then I have a 20 ounce can of crushed pineapple. Put everything in there. Liquid and all. Then I have about a 21 ounce can of blueberry pie filling. You want to put squish your um, crushed pineapple down too. So put that in there. And this stuff is really good. I made it yesterday for the first time and everybody loved it. And I got ice cream tonight, so it's going to be even better. This makes, like, a cobbler. So. Every little bit of that, that, that. Get every little last bit of it in there. Spread that around like you did your pineapple. Like that. Turn the light on. There you go. It'll look like that. So, now that you have that all down, and get your cake mix. You can use white cake mix, yellow cake mix, pretty much any cake mix that you desire. And all you're going to do, okay, what you're going to do is just sprinkle it on there. If you're not mixing it. You're just going to sprinkle it on there. All of it. Okay. And then, put this clean spoon. Pat it down. And anything on the sides, you kind of want to get that off of there, like the cake mix, because it will burn on the sides. It's like anything else. And I have my oven preheated for 375, and I'm going to leave this in here for about, like, between 35 in 45 minutes. It m might need a couple more minutes after that, depending on your oven and where you're at. Just keep an eye on it. Okay. So now I have a little over half a stick of butter sliced up. And you want to put these right on the top. Just like this. Yeah. Now this is salted butter. Um, I haven't used unsalted butter, so I don't know if it would make the taste different. So it doesn't have to be even. Just put it on there. Then. I will be right back, put this in the oven, and then I will show you what it looks like when it's done.
Okay, guys, so this is the finished product. That's what it's going to look like. It's going to get like that golden color. I'm going to turn the light on. Um, so it's going to look like that. And give me one second and I'll get it plated up with a little bit of ice cream and show you what it looks like. Like that. One second. Okay, so this is what it looks like. It could have stayed in there for maybe like a couple more minutes. Um, unfortunately, this dish, it kind of takes longer. Maybe if you messed with like the temperature, it would probably cook a little bit faster maybe. But um, that's what it looks like. It's really good. I'm going to spare you the sound of me chewing. Um, you guys should really try it out. It's really easy. You can use any kind of fruit that you want with it. The last one I use a little bit of brown sugar or dark brown sugar on top of the fruit and then put the um, cake mix on top. Um, this, like I said, it's really good, really easy. You can make it really cheap. It's, you know, fast prep. It just takes a little bit for it to cook in the oven unless you can figure out what the best temperature would to make it go faster without overcooking. Um, I hope you guys like this video. If you guys want to see more videos like this, please leave a comment down below, like this video, and don't forget to subscribe. Um, I'm going to be coming up with different kind of videos. I wanted to branch out from the paranormal. Um, so I hope you guys have a wonderful day, a wonderful night, or morning. Um,